Hey, it's Todd from TV8, and we're here with Haley from the town of Breckenridge. Hi, Haley. Hi, how are you? I'm doing great, and I'm really looking forward to uh, the Groundhog said there's going to be six more weeks of winter, so hopefully we'll actually get some snow this year. Yeah, I um, they're saying some snow is going to come today. I'm really hopeful. Um, we definitely need it for fun with skiing, but also as we um, think about our wildfire season. I know it seems really far away, but I don't know if people realize how critical um, snowfall is to that. So we are definitely hoping for six more weeks of winter. Yeah, thank you, Groundhog. Um, so today, I think you're going to tell people about uh, you know what's going on in Breck, some of the COVID updates and stuff. Yeah, so a few different COVID updates, you know, um, we were trending really well. Our numbers are starting to go up a little bit again. Um, so we do just want to continue to remind people, you know, keep that distance, um, stay home when you can, keep your groups really small, wash your hands, wear your masks. Um, you know, we are all sort of navigating what this winter looks like, um, but, you know, we are see starting to see a slight rise. Um, so we are encouraging people to continue to follow the things we've been doing all these months. Um, on the exciting end, though, is that, you know, Summit County is doing a great job at vaccinations. We are moving our way through the, the people, and um, we're really excited because the governor just announced um, that pretty soon, within the next week or so, we're going to be able to start vaccinating teachers and those who are 65 years old and older. Oh, that's um, great. Yeah, so we're really excited, you know. We know that teachers are just so critical to our community and getting our workforce back and going, getting our kids back in school. So we're very excited about that. And then, um, you know, if someone is watching this and they are 65 years or older, they soon will be able to register um, for a vaccination, which is really exciting. So we're working our way through and um, we're hopeful that, you know, as we vaccinate more people this spring and early spring, late spring that, um, you know, summer will be a really awesome, interesting time. Yeah. Do you think that uh, Breckenridge is going to kind of look somewhat normal this summer, maybe some events? Yeah, that's actually what we're talking about right now. Council is really focused on, um, you know, what events are we going to have? What's this summer going to look like? Are we going to potentially close down Main Street again? They haven't decided about that yet. Um, we are really looking for community feedback and input. So, you know, if you have an idea of what you would like events to be like in Breckenridge, um, please email us at mayor at town of .com and share your thoughts about what events you would like to see. You know, we think this is a really exciting time to kind of reevaluate all of our events and, and start with a clean slate and figure out what we want to do. But we are hopeful that, um, you know, this summer with more and more people getting vaccinated, we'll get to add, you know, some of the more, um, the flow back into Breckenridge. You know, we're talking about um, some fun ideas and we'll see what comes into fruition, but some ideas of like, how could in one event we put together everything that we missed um, over the pandemic and kind of have a mishmash of things. So um, I personally am really excited for summer to see um, what it all look like. I'm so excited for it too. Um, is there any uh, where you want to direct someone a website to uh, learn more about your, um, you know, protocols or anything? Yeah, so, you know, pretty much the town of Breckenridge.com, we've got a whole page of what you need to know about COVID. Um, we've also got some links to the tourism office. So if someone's visiting and they want to know, you know, what's open, what's not open, what can we do, they can check that out. And we've got a lot of great information about what to expect when you're visiting and, you know, what um, is new and what's going on if you are local here. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, Haley. We love catching up with you and uh, yeah, we'll see you again soon. Yes, looking forward to it. Talk soon.